bigger, better, stronger. X-Way X1 Max. So this is the latest X-Way electric skateboard and it's meant to be sort of like an update for the X-Way X1 Pro. This is a stiff deck, it has a really nice concave and um, I tell you what, I'm gonna go try it a little bit and I'll let you know what I think about the first ride. So I went for a quick ride, but before I talk about performance, I just wanted to show you quickly what was in the box. We have this very fancy letter where they basically thank you for purchasing the product for your support. We also have a couple of stickers, pretty nice. We got instruction manual and quick start guide that come in this nice little box. So one, you have all the features and settings, and this one is just, you know, you wanna quickly get into your board so you can. We have a little back here with a micro USB charger for your remote, a spare screw and Allen keys. We have here a T2 and I left the charger at home, but it came with a few cables. So this is for the American market, European market. I have a Honda one for the Chinese market. I live in China. And of course, we also have the remote, which is the same remote that actually have been using for forever, basically, since the X-Way X1. Comparing the Max to the Pro is inevitable. The Max is just a little bit longer, but really there isn't much difference on size. It's maybe like two centimeters longer and one centimeter wider. They're about the same thickness and they use roughly the same premium materials on both. But when you're riding, the Max feels like it's so much bigger. I don't know how, I don't know how to explain it, but it just feels more comfortable. I have a much wider stance when I'm riding it and generally speaking, it's just more comfortable. Now, when it comes to design, we have a two millimeter thickness of um, grip tape. The grip tape design is a little bit more futuristic. They have these lines, but also I want to remark that these lines that they have here at the bottom also help you, guide you on where to put the feet. Now, the concave is a little bit more pronunciated, which makes it more easy to get your feet in place without having to look down too much. The Max have the latest Hobbywin ESC. If you've been following this channel, you know that I'm a big fan of Hobbywin ESC. So this having the latest Hobbywin ESC, well, that means it that is basically the best ESC on any electric cable and it performs really well. But when you compare it to the x wave one Pro, when it comes to performance, we haven't noticed much of a difference. Here you can see a racing monkey. He's on the x wave one Pro. He's about two, three kilos lighter than me. And I think he's carrying a backpack. So we are more or less equal on weight. And you can see that there isn't much of a difference, if any. When it comes to the tracks, the X-Way X1 Max have the CNC in-house design three tracks, X-Way tracks. And I know it's like they're doing it themselves. Usually when premium boards, um, they're premium because they have third-party tracks that they, from some brand that is very good, like a Seismic or Paris tracks. But in this case, I gotta say, 
The three strikes are the best I have ever tested, period. They, they're better than the previous tracks, the, the Seismic on the X1 Pro. This just feels so good. Another thing that I gotta say is that the range got uh, like a big improvement. So before with the X-Way X1 Pro that they claim 20 kilometers, I got somewhere around 16, even less if I'm riding very aggressive. Now with the X-Way X1 Max, I'm getting way over 20. So that's a big win for me because before I was falling a little bit short, but now, well, it's pretty good. It, it comes to a decent level when it comes to range. I know there are some other boards that have a lot more range, just like the X-Way Atas, but this is rock solid range, speed, performance. Another thing is like, I've been riding the whole day, as you can see, we make a stop on a five-star hotel to get a refreshment. And after riding the whole day, we just complain about being hot, but I'm not tired. My legs are okay. It's very, uh, it's a very comfy ride. Uh, I think having that wider stance is what makes it very comfortable because I can assure you, with the X-Way X1 Pro, I will get tired. With the X1 Max, I don't. So that's a, like a huge advantage over the X, S-Way X1 Pro. So X-Way always do these things with boards where they kind of go into a, a one category. Like this one, it's a stiff board. If you have a background on downhill skating, this is it. It's either this or the X-Way X1 Pro. There isn't that much out there to buy when it comes to a stiff board, especially in this kind of quality, because it's really premium. Uh, X-Way did the same with the X-Way Flex. It's one of the best flexible decks uh, a flexible board out there and the S-Way Atlas which is hands down the best AT board I ever ride and also have the best shortboard with the X-Way Wave so you know they have these categories very clear for you to choose and they're the best at each and definitely without any doubt they are the best stiff decks out there ever so if you want to buy this board there are links in the description down below if you enjoyed this video it was somehow helpful or informational make sure to like comment and subscribe this is Kevin from Ray Studios. I'll catch you up on the next video.